not yet. This Batathon is a killer. Even Stoker can't fake enthusiasm anymore. A bit off more than we can drink for our first Batathon, have we? Well, uh, Lady Cryptina, we, uh... All flapped out already, are we? Let's see where we are. Uh-huh, yes, one of my favorite little cemeteries. Okay, my little wing flappers, listen up. Follow me down. We're going to land and take a break. As beautiful as it is here, we can't linger long. Dawn is coming soon. Uh, Lady Cryptina, my dawn meter says we have more than an hour before the sun rises. Your what? My dawn meter It's programmed to automatically warn of the coming of dawn every day of the year for the next several centuries. Are you sure? Yes. I inputted a database of the next thousand years of sunrises and sunsets. I assure you they are completely accurate. Well, okay. In the name of science, we will honor your device. We rest 45 minutes before flying back to the castle. Hey! Yeah. Yeah. Hmm? What are you doing? Don't you know about cemetery mud and fresh crushed beetles are the best facial a vampire can have? Mm. Would you make sure my face is completely covered, please? By the way, doesn't your little friend Sunstain live near here? Tell me. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry, missed a spot. Hmm. Hmm. What is it about humans you find so fascinating? It's hard to explain. They're so different, so wonderful. They're so full of... Mm, Blood? Life. Same thing. Listen, Oscar, you're my friend, so you know I'll do anything for you. But if you're ever caught with... <gasps> Son! Son! I should have trusted my instincts. Children, transform and fall into the emergency flight pattern. Hurry up! No! This can't be! The sun isn't due for another hour! Now's not the time, Lychee. We have to get home before we all become charred barbecue. Hurry up! Off to the castle, now! Wait a second! Claude! Where's Claude? Oh no! We left him behind! Claude! Claude, where are you? The sun's coming! Claude, wake up! What are you doing? Come on! Transform! We have to fly now! I can't, Oscar. I'm too <gasps> tired. You go. I'll catch up later. No, we have to go now. The sun will be here soon. We have to hurry and find some place safe. Are we playing hide and seek? Um, yeah, hide and seek from the sun, and don't let it catch you, okay? Here. Let's hide in here. Oh, you found me. Now I tag no, you and you're in. What? Oh, okay, this isn't gonna work. Okay, I guess we're left with no other choice. Let's go. If we don't hide somewhere from the sun, we'll end up like Ashley. I think Ashley's quite pretty, Oscar. Sunshine's house. Might work. Hold on, Claude. We're almost there. Too close. Hey, let's do it again! Uh, maybe later. Right now, I think... Finally, a sunny day! Hey there! Oscar! And you brought an adorable little friend! I'll be right out! 
No, uh, I mean, little clot here gets uh, overheated in the sun and... Uh, I turn to ash. Uh, what he really means is that his skin turns kind of ashy. Well, maybe you should come inside. Yeah, that'd be great. But uh, there wouldn't be a quieter room, would there? And darker? Hmm, well, the only place that I can think of is the basement, but you don't want to go in there. Perfect. Oh, well, okay, the door's around the corner. I'll, I'll meet you there. Ah. I love the smell of garlic in the morning. It smells like... Victory! Hey, where's Oscar? He was with you last I saw, as usual. And what about Kitty Cart Clot? Where's he? Oscar? Clot? Oh, my Dracula! I left them out there in that terrible daylight. Press flat up against the side of the house, okay? On your tippy toes. Are we playing sneak attack? Uh, yes. And we must be very careful. Now, the first thing you need to do is sneak towards the door. Ow! Uh, oh, I had no idea you were so into rugby, Oscar. <clears throat> Sunshine, this is Clot. Clot! This is sunshine. Bring the garlic, bring the garlic, and the vampires will cry. Bring the garlic, bring the garlic, and the vampires will cry. Out of the pan and into the fire. Who oh. oh, could this be at such an hour? Um, Kip, stay along, because it's school. Oh, that strange boy, Oscar, and... Ah, he brought another little one with him. Hmm? A teeny tiny vampire in my basement. Today will be a great day for I, the one and only Professor Paulus Polidori, will capture not one, but two vampires and have double the proof. Oh, this is terrible. Two students out in the sun on my watch! Quick, the largest tube of VSP-60 we have! It's all my fault. But everything was working flawlessly. What went wrong? Shall I inform the Count? No, they're my responsibility. I will find them and bring them back. If 60 minutes is enough time. If only I knew where to look first. Uh, Lady Cryptina? The cemetery where we rested? Well, it's not far from Polidori's house. What if he found them first? Never! Oh, look. He must be really hungry. Maybe I should get him something to eat. Uh, no. No, no, that won't be necessary. Uh, we really kind of have to... Huh? Garlic! We really have to go outside now. Wait, I thought you said that. Never mind what I said. Come on. Please, first you don't want to go outside. Now you can't wait. <gasps> oh no, son! Quick, Clark, cover your face with mud. Oscar, what is going on here? Uh, I tripped. Sorry, because uh, because the sun got in my eyes. <laughs> Never fear, Sunshine. I will save you. Uh, sorry, Sunshine, but we, we, we really have to be going now. Come on, Clot. Grandfather, what are you doing now? And the <gasps> vampires will come. No, 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 Grandpa, they're not vampires. They're my friends. Ah! <laughs> Transform. Hurry up, we have to get back to the castle now. I can't see anything. All the better, dear. Then you won't witness the horror of being savaged by vicious vampires. 
He's just like the little piggy I always knew him to be. Come, my little mud hens. You can't escape me! I'll get you! There they are! Yippee! Finally! Leechy, you should really check your equipment. Oscar, I am so sorry. I forgot to factor in the gruesome concept of <laughs> daylight savings time. Oh, yeah, that's right. All the clocks spring forward one hour today. Oh, dear, Oscar. Not only did you nearly become Ashley's twin brother, now you're going to lose an hour of sleep, too. <laughs> it's so much.